All right, this is the 2020 Thor Miramar 32.2. storage more storage got your furnace got your outside TV here which I can't open it with one hand but there's an outside TV there take my word for it got your fresh water tank there You got your batteries and your hydraulic pump. You got your propane. And of course, you have a slide out here that's for the bed. Add ladder to the roof. LED lights. Gas tank. Super slide. Of course, I'm not going to go through all those because they're up underneath the slide, but you got more storage all across. Make sure that your power hookups and your waste tanks are down there. Hot water here. Go take a look inside. Automatic steps. Come inside. This looks like tile, but it is linoleum. We'll immediately have a look at the big airy cockpit here. First thing before I forget, it does, whoops. It does have an overhead bunk that comes down. You have some cabinet storage up here. You got your fans on each side. Nice large uh, backup camera radio uh, display. Plenty of cup holders all around. Got your leveling system over there. That makes out into a desk. You got 12 volt on both sides, which is nice. Around over here by the door. Typical, you got storage above the door. Nice cabinetry. You got controllers down there. You got your solar uh, solar charge controller, your uh, lights, all that kind of stuff there. Over on this side, you got a dinette that folds down into a bed. You got cabinet storage up above. Big. You got a large TV there. And you get a nice little uh, counter there. That's pretty neat. You can put up pictures, whatever. Knickknacks. A lot of storage here over the theater seating. I'll open one of those for you. Typical. Into the kitchen on the right here, driver's side. Get storage up underneath with a trash can. More storage, of course, drawers all the way down. You got storage up underneath. This has the nice uh, two burner uh, gas stove, or gas, yeah, stove with the induction cooktop. Of course, you got a convection oven here because you don't have an oven down below. You got more storage up here. Uh, very nice residential faucet. This is actual metal. Not plastic like some of the other ones. Corian countertops with a double stainless steel sink. If I can get this in there without making too much noise. All right. So coming back, you look over here at the right, you do have a residential style fridge. If I can open it there, here you go. With an ice maker, it's nice. And typical residential fridge. Very nice. 
sure this has the inverter with it. Bathroom, got a nicer toilet than most uh, motorhomes, uh, lower grade. That you can tell this is a higher grade motorhome. Towel rack, you got your cabinets up there. It's kind of very short to the back. Same as this for the medicine cabinet. You do have some controls in here as well as controls over here and your outlet. You have a uh, steel sink with a plastic faucet. I'm disappointed about that. Uh, little cubby holes all around here. And you got your shower. It is a curved shower. Opens up like that. Nothing fancy, but it will do the job. This has like a little latch on it. And you have a place for a towel over here as well. This has a sliding door. So you automatically go right in here. You got a pantry, if you didn't see this beside the fridge, it's kind of dark in here, but you have a pantry with a couple pull-out drawers there. Sorry about that. You have what can be a wardrobe. There is a closet up here, but there's some shelves and you can't see. There's some shelves. There's some nice uh, slide-out drawers there. You can come in here to the bedroom. You got a king-sized bed. This is on a slide-out. You have storage up above. You got USB outlets there. Same as over here. And then on this side, you have your wardrobe. There's a table that goes up in between the two captain seats up front. Nice big, nice long wardrobe. And of course you got some drawers, you got a bunch of drawers all down here, uh, all, all across there, nice little vanity, and of course your TV. All right, so this is the 2020 Thor Miramar 32.2. Last look at it here. I forgot to mention, you do have a sliding door to block off the bedroom from the rest of the area, so.